everyone, welcome back to another video, and today we are going to be doing how to use Vlogster. But it's version 2. Um, so, basically, in the original how to use Vlogster video, I did, or covered, all the basic stuff in Vlogster, and there is a lot of stuff that I worked out, but that is also because there is a lot of things in Vlogster to cover. Um, I, since then, I did make a couple of videos, um, on specific things, like last video, you guys need to get speed, um, well, because someone requested that, but still, and so today, I'm technically going to be doing what we did in the last time we used Vlogstar video, but it's going to be longer, and it's going to be covering the rest of the stuff, the stuff that I didn't cover, so, um, yeah, uh, I guess we're gonna start off with all the clip tools that you could use. I didn't act, I actually didn't use this at all. Um, but fill natural. Uh, so basically what it is, is when you record with a phone, um, it's gonna be kind of tall like that, you know, it's gonna be what the actual phone size is. Um, and it's gonna be nice for people watching on a phone for good reasons. But with Phil, it's, it looks way nicer, you know, there's no background or anything like that, and I don't really suggest using that in your videos. Um, then there's crop and rotate. Crop, uh, th I guess these are all pretty basic things. Uh, you can rotate it a little bit, so it's like that. One degree. Um, looks no different from regular, but still. And then you can rotate it. Obviously, make it upside down. If you want to, you can mirror it. You can also flip it upside down, which is kind of the same as rotate. Um, but there's also speed. I covered that in the last video, but you can make it in slow mo. You can make it super speed. Just leave it at normal. You can also make it so it changes the pitch or not. I know, obviously, there's no body on this right now, but still. Um, then there's anime. I covered this in the last video, but it's the key binding tool. Okay, but then uh, there's filter. This is the all the regular camera cam camera filters. There's some other other stuff in there. Um, so yeah, uh, you can. There's also adjustment. Um, you can also do this on a regular camera app or whatever. You can change the brightness. It's really bright or really dark or really. Really, really dark. So now it looks like it's nighttime. Like a lot. But still. And then you can. The next thing is, is there's also FX effect. Um, there was a couple of people in the comments saying that they still didn't really understand it. Probably because I didn't really un under. Or explain it that well. I kind of just said, eh, hey, you can make it. So it's got an effect on it. That's not explaining. So basically what it is, is I don't know what FX stands for, because I'm stupid, but still. Um, it, you can basically make it so it has like a kind of cool little animation to it. Um, going back to the shadowy one, you can make it so, now obviously it's in film mode, so it's really hard to he see it. You can make it do that as well. Um, then there's Ken Burns, which, and with, uh, it on full screen, it's actually really useless, but it's also kind of useless, because there's also the key binding tool, and you can do the exact thing, key binding, um, but it's just with this, you can make it so it moves across the screen, and again, you can't really see that right now, because it's in full Um, then, you can, um, there's freeze, so you you can basically take a picture and keep it there for a little bit to watch. Okay, I'm not going to lie, that works really cool. I might take a screenshot of that later. But so, um, so right here would be a really good shot, you know, it looks like it's night and all that. And that just shows you 
that the editing power that you have with this is amazing. This is why Vloxer is my favorite editing app. And I, sure, I have an editing app on my computer because, well, I need an editing app on my computer. And the sad thing is you can't use Vlogstar on PC, which sucks, but I think it looks really cool because obviously before it was daytime and now it actually looks like you put a camera in a bush and took a screenshot of the sky. That I think that's just really cool. Um, so yeah, and then you can also make it to the videos in reverse. Um, and I can't show you this now because, well, there's no audio on it, but, um, the audio actually stays the same, so the video will be in reverse, but the audio will be the same, so it'll look really weird. Um, but yeah, man, you can barely see it, but it's going back. Now, it's kind of hard to see because... Oh, when, when it's daylight, you can obviously see there's a lot of trees right there, um, but yeah. Um, so that's basically it for crop, um, there's a lot of stuff that I take kind of cover though. Um, I did show that, like, you could use green screen and stuff in the last video, uh, but they did add overlay, which is... It, it, yeah, this basically is the green screen. There's the, the gifts that you can do. So you can make it so it's like that. You can, again, use the fill thing on it. Now, the fill thing all, won't always work. There will be times where it won't work, um, which sucks. And if you quick fill, it... It kind of just, you can't see the text at the bottom, but yeah, and then, um, so that you, you can use that, um, and then you can make a background and also add the transition, so, um, this is, well, most YouTubers don't use this app, but you can do this. The next day, it's just to fill. That's another thing. Nice thing about Phil is it's way easier, so you don't have to resize it. Um, as you can, let's just refill that. So, the next day, and there you go. It's it's going in reverse, but um, yeah. And then you can also change the filter from here. I mean, literally the entire video. Um, so yeah. You can remove the watermark from here. Now, I, I did state and then hi, the how to use box I wanted to that. You can't remove this or you can't remove it or add a custom one without VIP. And VIP is... <laughs> oh my gosh, it's only 13 bucks. <laughs> so yeah, you should probably go buy that before it's not 70% off. And that's really nice. It, it's normally like 20 bucks, I think, which is kind of expensive, but um, Forever VIP is only $13 right now, so as this video goes up, you should probably download Vlogstar and buy it. Wow, the 70% sale last. So yeah, now obviously I'm not going to buy it right now, but um, yeah. Yeah, on the transition, you can make it so it something, I don't know. But, yeah. And then, you can, and then that's pretty much it. Now, you can also use sound effects. My personal favorite is this one. like that one uh you could also do voiceover i don't know if it'll allow me to allow me to do it because i'm actually screen recording right now hello okay i'm still screen recording but yeah i guess you can do it while screen recording which is kind of cool um so hello 
Okay, yeah, so still. Um, and then here you can do the beat edit. You can do, put it on auto so it kind of vibrates whenever it thinks there's a beat right now. Hello? Okay, stop. But, and then you can obviously change the volume. You can copy and delete it. Pretty basic. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah, that's, that's most of the stuff. Uh, I know there's custom stickers, which I actually don't think you can do. Um, yep, that's VIP. So, um, yeah, you can't use that. And, um, yeah. You can do this if you want to. But you can see the exact positions. All that. I don't know why there's two recordings there, so I... <laughs> So that is kind of helpful. Um, and then you can up plus the plus button. You can and right also now. play the video. Yeah. So that's yeah, it's basically it. There's not much of it to show because I did cover a lot of it in last video. Um, there is some like additional things that you can do uh again with green screen if you go do pip um and just pick whatever green screen you want okay um but and then you can do chroma or chroma chroma um yeah, it kind of sounds like the coronavirus. Chroma, corona. Dun dun dun. Um, but you can also make it so it fits with the screen. You can split it if you want, so you can make it louder at one point. You can animate it. Blend? I'm actually not sure what that does, uh, but, um, yeah. And then you can freeze it, copy it, and detach the audio from it. Which is really cool because detaching the audio is fun and it's useful. Um, so yeah, uh, thanks guys for watching. Um, this video is what like ten minutes long. Let me check. Thirteen minutes. But um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um. If you still have any questions or are still confused about something, just let me know and I will see if I can explain it better because I'm sometimes not very good at explaining things. Yeah. Um, so anyways, I'm just going to watch the full video here. I mean, I don't really need to, but I'm going to anyways. So, uh, yeah. right now hello okay i'm still screen recording but yeah i guess you can do it while screen recording the which next is kind of day okay so yeah there you go boom 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 okay but um so yeah that's it um i think there is one more thing i know I keep saying that's it for the video, but someone was asking, how do you take out some clips or cut out the middle of a video? All you simply do is split it, delete it, and that part of the video will now be gone. Um, on top of that, as you kind of just saw me do there, you can expand this. Um, so, <laughs> you, so if you because I like moving. It's literally going to go by the speed of light. I'm not even joking. So if I change it, so as you can see here, it looks huge. It looks like it would be an hour long, but no, it's not. Not at all. Um. So yeah, what is it? And then just go all the way back to the start, and I think it's probably gonna go so fast that you might not even be able to catch it. Because 
that's literally how fast it's going to go. It goes faster than a millisecond, maybe faster than that. And it's obviously, st okay, so that's as short as I can make it for some reason. I think it's because it's that short, but watch. <laughs> so if I just squeeze everything back in, it looks tiny. <laughs> you know, you can barely catch what it says. So if there's two words in there, I actually right now. If you're not a fast reader, you wouldn't be able to catch that. So yeah, thanks guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below. I would also like to say thank you guys so much for 70 subscribers. We're almost to 100. Um, so yeah, I'm excited, but. Again, thanks guys for 70 subscribers. Um, yeah. Uh, so, um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you all later. Bye! Bye!